All right, you guys, so the fishing has been kind of tough lately. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put two different fishing days together because I caught like one or two fish on one day, maybe two on the other day. Anyways, I'm gonna put those two days combined, but do be on the lookout for my newer videos coming out because here recently the bite has been pretty good in the neighborhood. I'll give you guys a hint as to what I've been fishing lately. It's been a lot of finesse techniques. So the drop shot and the Ned rig are key. I believe in the videos you guys will watch today. I did catch some on the drop shot. Anyways, let's get started with the video. It's going to be a short one, but do be on the lookout because I did catch some big bass here pretty recently. Hope you guys enjoyed. Look at that blow up. That was a big one. <laughs> Come on, bass. You can't tell me they're not seeing this Kitek down there. Pretty close to the blow up, pretty close. Oh, there's a wake right here, look at that. That was real shallow. Come on, bass, come on. There we go. There we go. We got one. <laughs> Bass number one. Good bite too. He bit it pretty hard. I'm keeping tension on him. Thank you for biting. A little bit tough. A little bit tough. But we got one. We got one. He's fired up too. Hooked on the side of the mouth. Pop that right out of you. Bass number one. Let's throw him back in. There he goes. All right, you guys. I was unhooking my trash over here. Alejandro caught one on the grub. Nice, Alejandro. <laughs> so he just got here. Caught one very quickly. This is probably a good bait imitation, the little grub. I think that's bigger than the first one I caught. Eh, they're about the same. You throw them in, I throw them in. I'll throw it in. Nice one, nice one. There we go. Nice. Bass number two. Finally. Oh, he's hooked on the bottom of the mouth. We gotta be careful. There we go, pop that right out of him. That's number two. Let's let him back in. There we go. There we go. Nice. 
Oh man, finally. Fast number one. You wanted that Yamamoto Senko. <laughs> it's crazy. Tough deal fishing. Tough. He's so green. He stays in that grass. Look at him. It's about a pound something. He's shaking. He's shaking. Let's put him back in. Thank you. Good lord! <laughs> He's bending my rod, you guys. Wow! Oh! Pass number two. Lengthy one. Lengthy one. Ooh. He's fired up, too. Barely hooked, too. Wow! Look at that. Let's put him back in. He's angry. There he goes. Wow. That was nice. All right, you guys. That's going to be all for today's video. So like I said at the beginning, that was two different days of fishing. I caught two fish the first time. That was here at the neighborhood pond. And then the second time was over at the Mont Bellevue City Park Pond. Very tough day of fishing there. I ended up catching those two bass back to back. I believe that was on the Texas Rig Sanko within about 20 minutes. And then we had like three hours of no fish caught no bites it was pretty tough actually now that i remember i did have some blow-ups on top water i'm still trying to experiment with that hopefully eventually we can catch a fish on that little top water bait that white one i think i've had like four or five bites on that but still no fish have gotten hooked anyways if you enjoyed today's video you guys please give it a thumbs up thanks for watching comment rate and subscribe